Hey, what's going on? In this video, you are going to learn exactly how to instantly stop overthinking in business because overthinking kills momentum. Overthinking leads to procrastination. Overthinking leads to the overcomplication, overcompli if that's a word. You overcomplicate things that can be very simple and effective. So it's gonna be a quick video because this is a quick technique. But hear this, we think from the state we are currently in. And what I mean by that is whatever state you're in now, all of your thoughts emanate from that state. So when we are in an anxious state, every thought that we have, well, we are in an anxious state, well, our, our physiology is anxious and our neurology is anxious, is an anxious thought. Even the best thought you have when you are anxious is still an anxious thought. When you think about the future, you're gonna think of all the things that could go wrong. When you think about the past, you're gonna, you're gonna focus on, you're gonna hone in on anxious times, bad times from the past. When we're in a powerful state, let's say we just closed the biggest deal ever, we're feeling good, we're feeling fulfilled, and we think about the future, we're thinking good things. We think about ourselves. we're thinking good things. We think from the state we are in. And so this is important when it comes to when you're, because we have to think in business. You, get, you, know, you need to plan and strategize and project and optimize and learn and objectively audit information and plan for the future. So yeah, you can't get around it, right? A fair amount of thinking goes into business. But we overthink because we, when we approach our business, we are in the wrong state. A lot of people frantically approach their business right? Almost as if they're behind the eight ball. And so they're in this state of I'm not where I need to be yet. And then when they think about the future, guess what? They're thinking from the state of I'm not where I need to be yet. So everything they're thinking about is just a reflection of how they're not going to be where they need to be, how they're not succeeding. Da, 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 da. And that's what leads to overthinking, right? And another way to think about this is if let's say you were wearing a, a pair of red tinted glasses, right? Everything you see out of those glasses, even the least red thing you see will still be tainted a little bit by red, will still be a shade of red. And so when it comes to thinking clearly in business, it's not, there's no thinking hack. It's about getting into a better state when it is time to think about business. So let's say when you're doing your quarterly planning or your yearly planning or your weekly strategizing or you're, you're, you're planning your daily time blocks. It's important to get into the right state because your state will determine the quality of your thoughts. That's why meditation is so important if you're a man in business. That's why fitness is so important if you're a man in business. That's why optimizing your sleep and your recovery is so important if, when you're a man in business. That's why doing inner work so you can remove all of the old stories and old fears and insecurities that live in your unconscious mind. That's why doing all of those things are so important because you don't need to bring any of that to your business. Business is mechanical. Business is about strategy that you execute and it either works and you keep doing it or it doesn't work and you optimize and implement something new. That's all business is, but we get stuck as men in business because we bring our negative emotional states to business. We bring all of our insecurities and stuff from our unconscious mind and we bring that, we look through that lens and that's what leads to overthinking. So you can do this right now. Right now, start breathing through your heart. Not literally, but <laughs> breathe as if each breath was coming in and out of your heart. And studies show that doing this just three, four times literally will neutralize a negative state. So right now, if you're at like a seven or an eight on the worked up scale, doing that will bring you down to a two, a one, or maybe a zero. And then you can think clearly again. You won't be intoxicated by a negative state. And if you want more resources, more meditations, more trainings to really own your state so you can think clearly and powerfully about business, just go to wakeupwealthy.com. We have tons of free trainings, free meditations, and free mindset hacks that will allow you to be clear, allow you to kind of rewire your unconscious program so you can optimize how you show up right now in the moment so you can think clearly about business. So to bring it all back one final time, Overthinking is not a thinking problem. Overthinking is a result of the state you are in. Control the state you are in and the thinking will follow. When you know this, when you master this, you can master consistent growth within your life and in your business and you can lead and you can change your life and you can help others change their lives. It's a very powerful skill to adopt. So adopt it. And again, if you want more tools, more trainings, wakeupwealthy.com, tons of stuff for you. See ya.